Okay, now what you're going to do is you're going to open up the program and go to the flow tab. You're going to make the pipe as wide as you can all throughout. And this step is really important, as you'll see later. It makes this lab a whole lot easier. So don't forget to do this or skip this step. Now you're going to enable your ruler. Make sure it's in metric units. You're going to turn on friction. You're going to place your ruler at the bottom of the pipe, which you're going to use as your zero point. You're going to take a speedometer, place it at a spot in the pipe, so where you can measure how far it is in. You're going to record the speed at that distance from the edge of the top of the pipe, and then you're going to pick 10 different spots. After you've picked those 10 different spots, you're going to change your flow rate and measure the speed at those same spots. Now you're going to change the flow rate again and measure the speed at those 10 spots. And now you're going to have three different flow rates with 10 different spots, and that's how you're going to do this.